Hi guys, shaking in again. Um, it's raining here today and what I was going to show you was how I drive. A lot of people have asked me, does it affect me driving? But with it raining today and we have a big long dirt driveway that will now be full of potholes and water. and <laughs> So I thought I'll do it on a sunny day when you'll be able to actually see. Um, because with ET it's funny, I don't realise but my hands and my feet help my tremors a lot they work it out for me um like when i was doing the crocheting and building the little cupboard um i look away a lot and let my fingers work it out they they seem to work it out themselves and my feet for my leg tremor in the car is what is the most trouble and my feet actually help me to drive without me even realising what they're doing. So I want to show you that and I'll show you that hopefully Tuesday, uh, Friday. Today's Tuesday. <laughs> hopefully Friday if it's not raining. Um, so today, guys, I, I absolutely had no idea. And then I thought I'll, I'll tell you about, I was watching a show the other night and it reminded me of a dream that I had about six months ago. Now, through my life, I've had little dreams that later on they've proven something. Um, but at the time, I can never work out what the dream is actually telling me. So when I first started thinking about doing these videos and putting my life out there, I had a dream one night. Um, and we were all, Shane and the kids and I, we were in this old house and the next minute this huge skeleton started chasing us and we all took off running and Shane and the kids of course were faster than me and I was lagging behind and this skeleton was getting closer and I thought how am I gonna I've got to protect the family so I turned around and I punched twice really hard into this skeleton the skeleton started to collapse and I started laughing out loud in real life because as I punched the skeleton I got woken up to Shane saying hey what the hell are you doing buddy <laughs> I was punching into Shane so it was a big laugh for all of us for all the family that good on you Shane you're letting me punch a skeleton out when you're the man now come on look after the family what are you doing so it was only when I was watching a movie the other night when um it was about a, a dream and about someone with skeletons and they punched the skeleton out and it clicked to me and it, I thought, that's what I did. That's why I had to punch that skeleton out in that dream because it was my skeleton that had to be punched out and I've punched him out. He's gone now, this skeleton, and it's getting out there and it's getting me out there and this is what it's all about. Um... So I just wanted to tell you that it was so funny when we um, when it was happening, but it only clicked to me a couple of weeks ago what that dream meant. So we've all got to knock them out. So hopefully, guys, you can all do it too because it's it's made me feel more confident. I'm more confident with you guys. I'm getting more and more confident every day out in public now. So that was just something funny I wanted to tell you. The shirts, guys. Now, I jumped the gun on Friday. I was so excited when I got the message from from Tinker Towns that the, the shirt designs were in. Then I went down to the post office. Our Australia Post is so expensive, guys. It's going to cost nearly the same price as the shirts to post them, which is ridiculous. We want to get these shirts out there. We want to get them out as cheaply as possible so that more people can afford them, more people can wear them and more people can be more comfortable. So what I've actually done, I've reached out. There is an ET lady, Cheryl Ansler in the UK, that is a shirt printer and she is going to print the shirts for UKers. Um, She's going to, she's got a business called Bunny and Moo. She's going to actually put up a, a shaking in line, which is great. And then you guys, it will be so much cheaper for postage for you. Um, and that's just amazing. We can spread this word. I'm also going to look at um, 
just ET essential trimmer. If you guys don't want the shaky net on there, that's fine. We might be able to get them taken off. It's just I've put the shaky net on there so that when people see the shirts, they have a reference to look at, to look it up and and have a look at what Essential Tremor is about. If they watch me, they will learn more about it. Um, and that's why I've put the hashtag shaky net on there. If people just see ET and Essential Tremor, they may not want to look that up when they get home. But seeing the hashtag Shaky Nan, it might spark their curiosity enough to have a look. Um, so now what I'm trying to do, I'm looking out, I'm reaching out for anyone in the USA that hopefully is an et -er and a printer because I'd love to help another et -er keep their business going as well. The lovely Cheryl, I, I mentioned last week that out of each shirt that gets sold in the UK and in the USA, I will donate a, a portion of my profit to the NTF and to the IETF. Cheryl, Cheryl has also offered to um, give a donation out of each shirt to the NTF out of her profit as well. So that's um, this way we're helping the foundations over there as well. Um, I'm not taking the money out of your country and it's also going to the foundations to help um, find us that cure that we so desperately need. So guys, thank you very much for all your support. I'm just amazed at the support and the the, the comments I get off people and 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 how I'm helping other ETs is just amazing. I love you all, guys. This was short and sweet today. Um, hopefully Friday I can show you how I drive. All right, guys, take care. Love you all. Knock them skeletons out. That's what we need to do. All right, guys, see you on Friday. Have a great shaky week. Bye.